most important reason for using a list though, however, is this. Is that when you use a list and you work down the list and you check things off, each time you check something off on a list, it gives you a feeling of accomplishment. You can tell what is more important and what is less important. Okay, now the fourth principle for effective time management is to set priorities. As a matter of fact, it is impossible for you to accomplish anything worthwhile in life without the ability to concentrate single-mindedly on one thing at a time and stay with it until it's complete. In fact, time and motion studies have shown that if you start a task and you put it down and you come back to it and pick it up and start it and put it down and come back to it and pick it up, that it will take you as much as 500% of the necessary time to do a task than if you picked it up and carried it through. Alec McKenzie, great time management expert. Alec McKenzie calls this single handling. Once you have made a list of what you have to do, organized your goals, determined the highest and most valuable priority, then pick the most important thing and begin working on it and stay with it until it's finished. Now people say, well, if I stay with this task until it's finished, I won't get anything else done. That doesn't matter. If it's the most valuable thing that you have to do, it's the most important thing that you could be working on. Now it's a wonderful thing. When you concentrate and work intensely on an important task, it gives you a feeling of energy and enthusiasm.